What's up, Gemini gang? Happy Friday, aka Venus Day, aka the day of love. Happy birthday, all June seventh, Gemini's. It's already June seventh, so we are already seven days into June. All right, we have what two weeks left for Gemini season. Our season always flies by. I feel like. <sighs> All Gemini placements take what resonates, a leave of the rest. Take it how it resonates with you and your situation. Now, didn't we see this yesterday? Personal readings are in the description box uh, on the website. Hit those likes, hit those likes, hit those likes, hit that subscribe. I appreciate you guys a ton. Okay, so we have wedding. This is going to be a you versus them. This is why I'm not uh, actually on the camera. Cause I like for you guys to see the cards for the you versus them. Okay. So we have codependency and I believe this came out yesterday in another deck and another, um, Oracle deck, I believe. Right. And then we have make the efforts. Okay. So there's some codependency here. Um, somebody's addicted to you. Also, when I was meditating for you, Gemini's, I feel like, um, Someone feels like you have the wrong idea about them or if they don't want you to view them how you currently view them. Okay, so, you know, we'll see what comes out. Somebody feels like you have the wrong idea about them, um, whether that's true or not. Okay, but, you yeah, know, we'll see. <laughs> and, of course, if you're new here, person on your mind, side, your side. Okay, well, then, six of wands. <sighs> King of Cups, uh -huh. Seven of Cups, all right? So let's see what's going on here. Um, could be a Scorpio for some of you. Uh, someone doesn't know where they stand, or like I said, they feel like you you don't have the right idea about them, um, Gemini's. Somebody's gonna pull up on you, or... Um, Mm, Gemini. Someone may do like some type of um, some type of public apology or something, uh, Gemini, or some type of public display of love or something like that to like get your attention. Especially if you have them blocked. The Empress here uh, on the bottom. Yeah. Someone doesn't know where they stand with you. I feel like they think highly of you with this Empress card here. Some of you have children with this person. Gemini's, whoever this is loves you and cares about you. Uh, Gemini's, they may not speak a lot or <laughs> say it, uh, but I also feel like too this person like wanting to talk but not really knowing what to say. Like this person doesn't know really doesn't really know like how to go about dealing with you or being with you or getting out of whatever rut you two are in. Um, Gemini's, let's check y'all side see what's going on with a uh, you a gemini's okay we're starting off with the eight of wands a bunch of other cards came out okay uh two of cups mm, interesting i feel like you're trying to move forward i feel like um it could be with this person could be you know on to something else i feel like you guys are kind of chugging along um you may have mm, Okay. <laughs> Ace of Pentacles. <sighs> Nine of Pentacles on the bottom. Some of you are just not really like stressed at all or like really worried about relationships. Um, or that shouldn't be your focus right now, Gemini's. And I know I got that in one of the reads, either the collective or something like that. Um yeah, you want you either want something new or you are good kind of like on your own. Like you've kind of direct, redirected your energy to something else. And again, Gemini's on your side. I'm seeing something like financial wise um, improving for you. Oh, yikes. 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 Okay, we have the Ten of Swords in here. Yeah, Gemini's. The Ten of Wands. The Queen of Cups here on the bottom. Oh, well, Divine Pair here. Mm -hmm. Now, with the Ten of Wands and the Ten of Swords, the Tens, of course, are about uh, endings and beginnings. So, some of you want something new. Like, you you kind of want... Even if this person comes in, like, in a new energy, because that could be the thing for some of you, 
but you want something new Gemini. It's like you're kind of chugging along that's kind of what i'm getting you're contemplating some of you might still be with this person or this person's in the picture still or again like we saw the empress earlier y'all might have children or there's a child involved um something like that but you like contemplating like leaving this behind if you haven't already others of you you've already left um and you're moving forward like a lot of you guys are like getting your momentum back you're getting your mojo back after being or feeling stuck for a long time um gemini's some of you feel like this person like wronged you too like this person you feel like this person um did something that they can't come back from it's like you something was like the last straw for you that's that's kind of what i'm getting with this and you are you kind of like dead at the situation here you want your love life to be a little bit more uh you want your love life to be easier um i wouldn't even say easier i would say you know more more uh, more being able to tolerate it more that's that's what i'll say uh gemini's because i don't feel like you mind things being hard i don't feel like you mind tough times in a relationship but you like damn like it doesn't always have to be bad like <laughs> Sometimes it can be good, but I'm loving this energy. And of course, at, you know, the Ten of Swords, the sun might come out on your side or the lovers. But y'all know the Ten of Swords is like, this is the end of the overthinking. This is after the Nine of Swords. Okay, so the Nine of Swords is where you're going through the dark night of the soul. This is the card where, you know, you're bring, pretty much being taken out of your misery. And there is these dark clouds kind of moving out and you can kind of see like that sun peeking back there. So I feel like, Gemini, you've just been through a lot, I feel like. And now you are in a space of wanting something better for yourself. Uh, even if that means you are like more focused on your um, projects and financial stuff. You're getting out of a dark place, um, Gemini. And I feel like it's well-deserved for you. Like you, I feel like you've gone through a lot. And a lot of you, you feel like you've gone through enough. Okay, I'm seeing that the uh, Ace of Pentacles on your person's side. Child. King of Swords. Some of you dealing with Aquarius. So we, mm, some of y'all got more than one person on this side. Nine of Wands. Yep. Mm -hmm. Five of Cups. Somebody's not giving up on you. Gemini's. Even if you want them to. Like some of you, you might want this person to give up. <laughs> or one of these people. Um to give up but uh somebody's not giving up at all uh gemini somebody's not letting up there's some regret here too there's also oh gosh i got this in a collective read there's there's some um substance use on your person's side could be alcohol um something along the lines of that could be um you know some other drug or whatever the case may be gemini y'all know i gotta watch what i say that's why i can't wait till the patreon's up but um you know some other recreational stuff okay five of pentacles might it might be, be uh might be putting them i can't talk either so this person might be having a hard time communicating it might be um causing some type of financial strain uh with this person or this person is just having some type of financial strain but they have a lot of regrets and I feel like they try to get rid of their regrets by like using um, substances. Okay, that's, that's what I'll say. All right. Never know when you're going to get flagged. But um, yeah, a Gemini, someone isn't uh, quite ready to give up on you. Someone loves you. I feel like they also don't like the fact that they love you sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> because I feel like some of you guys are, are kind of over a situation um, or you want something new or you have shifted your focus. Some of you are tired of like being in the same thing. You're tired of feeling stuck. Yeah. Okay. Four of Swords. Yeah, you feel like this person did something to you. Five of Swords. Yeah, Gemini's. Ten of Cups. See, I'm seeing the Seven of Wands. I saw the Seven of Wands here too. And you, you see how she's kind of turned like her. Look how she looks in this picture. That's kind of how I get with you. It's just like, nope. Mm -mm, no. Um, you feel a way about this person. Also, does this person owe you some money or something? Like, <laughs> 
Yeah, that's the case for some of you. Y'all are overthinking as well. Like there's something here that, that you could have been overthinking. But with the Ten of Swords, it's like you're kind of getting out of that. So you were thinking about this for a long time. You did pull away from this person, like quick, fast, in a hurry. You detached from this person. Um, and this person's not getting your your love and attention anymore, uh, Gemini's. It's because you feel a way about something that they did. Okay? So the Five of Swords it can sometimes be about anger. The Five of Cups can be about sadness and regret. So I feel like there, there's a sadness on their side and there might be a little bit of anger and resentment um, on yours. Okay, so. Take that how it resonates with you. And I'm saying that because y'all have kind of, yeah, six of swords. You guys have kind of put your emotions on the back burner because especially when it comes to this person because you see like this little heart is like weaved out and it's next to her like your heart's not gone it's just you know you're not leading with that anymore you're kind of leading more so with logic um gemini's when it comes to this situation or in love in general <clears throat> you guys nothing wrong with that okay you cope however you see fit okay I don't be getting um, choked up until I'm on the readings. My voice don't be getting scratchy until I'm doing the videos. It's insane. Oh my goodness. I knew the three of swords was gonna come out. I knew it, but this is this is on top. The Knight of Pentacle, yeah. It's been a long time coming for you, uh, Gemini's. But there's that three of swords. I knew this was gonna come out. I figured it'll be their side though. Because there's the sadness is there. Ace of Cups, Four of Pentacles. Yeah, this mm, you feel a way about this person. You feel like this person hurt you, or you feel like this person did something foul and moved funny with you. I feel like you got tired of uh, this person playing games and stuff with you as well. Uh, Gemini, it's also taking you a long time to kind of detach from this too. Like with this Knight of Pentacles here, I feel like. Some of you have been going through something for a long time. It could be you've been going through it with this person for a long time. And now you're kind of over it, uh, Gemini's. You don't feel like it's worth it. Not the Nine of Wands. Y'all, somebody is not going to give up on you. Like ever. The Six of Wands again. The Justice, the Nine of Wands again, the Six of Wands again, and the Four. Yeah, someone's going to take that leap of faith. I'm going to take the Justice here someone's gonna take that leap of faith nine of wands again <laughs> could be a scorpio you're dealing with an aquarius libra six of wands yeah somebody has a lot of regrets the fool here but i feel like they're going to work through that someone's going to work through their issues like someone's going to work through um their fear, number one, and work through their sadness to like come towards you or to try to fix things with you. This is somebody that is, isn't is ready to give up at all. And I feel like somebody is, someone's trying to hold on to you. Whoever this is, is trying to hold on tight to you. And it's like, I'm hearing like, okay, we've put all this time into it. You know, we should be able to fix it. Some of you might get an apology heavy justice card here with the king of swords with the justice it's like something being made right somebody trying to do the right thing i'm gonna pull a couple more for the person on your mind side because i feel like um all these repeating energies yeah and now it comes out on their side ten of wands yeah, and the Queen of Cups. So this person feels like you're their divine counterpart. The Queen of Swords, uh, the King of Swords again, peeking out. Um, the Knight of Swords. So some of you dealing with an air sign. Um, could be a Sash, the Tempest is under there. Yeah, Gemini's look. I feel like this person is going to come in and tell you how much work they're willing to put in. They're going to come in and tell you how much they're willing to change. They're going to come in and tell you um anything that you that you want to hear now i won't say that they're not being genuine i just feel like there could be some type of uh addiction going on here with them that you may not be aware of 
Gemini. So some of you are, but there there could be some type of um recreational use, drug use. I feel like ever since the separation or ever since y'all been falling off, uh, this person has been using this to to cope. So just just a, a heads up on that, uh, Gemini's. Cause baby. <laughs> So two of wands flips over. Let me see what fell. Okay, this fell face down, but when I flipped it over, it was reversed. So um, it fell face down, I'm not gonna take it. But yeah, Gemini's, the fact that this was reversed, I feel like, yeah, y'all are just not, there's just something here you're just not like tripping on. Like, mm, no, you want better for yourselves, Gemini's, and you're not, you're not looking at this person anymore. I feel like you have, um, you are um, over it. Doesn't mean you don't love them or care about them. I'm not getting that. But I do feel like you're over it. You're over something. You want something better. Even if it's with this person, like I said, some of you would be okay if this person, you know, did better, or treated you better or whatever. You'd be, you'd be good with that. But I feel like you want better. Like some of you are kind of wishing that you had chose differently too. Ooh, yikes. My bad, cross watchers. Yeah. Mm hmm. The magician. The Ten of Wands here on uh, this side too. So I've, I'm seeing this on both sides. So y'all are mirroring each other, but I feel like in a different way. I feel like, Gemini, so you're kind of willing to put in the work in order to attract the right partner to you. And they're willing to put in the work order in order to attract you. Also, work on your thoughts too. Oh, and it comes out again. That's insane. That's why I love to show you guys um, stuff that flips over. Yeah. Wow. The Six of Swords as well. Healing. Um, the world. You're, you are on the verge of completing some type of cycle. Um, Gemini's. You're on the verge of completing some type of cycle. You are healing. You are working on your thoughts. And again, if you're not doing this, this is spirit telling you that you should. Okay. You're working on your thoughts. You are um, attempting to, to live a, a better quality life because I feel like you haven't been satisfied with your life, um, especially your love life right now. Okay. And I feel like spirit wants you to kind of get more intentional with what you want. Okay. Be very specific with what you want in a love connection. Also be very specific, and that's been a huge theme lately in the readings. Be very specific from if you want something from this person. Like you need to tell them exactly what it is that you want. Um, and don't settle for less, okay? Because sometimes we settle for, for certain things and then we get resentful because that's all they gave, okay? So you don't have to settle for anything if you don't want to. I'm seeing that you are willing to do the work move forward i'm seeing you moving forward this one this card is moving forward this is moving forward the eight of wands is moving forward so i feel like you're open to conversation with this person but i feel like ultimately you want more and if they're not able to give you more i feel like you are okay with moving on you are definitely um emotionally and mentally detaching from someone uh gemini's and i feel like they have a lot of regrets for not speaking up. They have a lot of regrets for not um, giving you that reassurance, Gemini's, that you wanted and that you needed. So you you kind of feel, um, I feel like some of you feel betrayed <clears throat> by this person. You feel betrayed. You feel like, you know, they did you dirty. Okay, split in the deck, I'm seeing 333. Three, three. Could be dealing with a fire sign here. Yeah, they know that too. Everybody knows by John Legend. <laughs> now that song is about finding somebody else. So I feel like you're open to like finding another person. Like that's just what it is. And again, I want you so bad. I feel like this is what is going on here. And it could be, you know, different people here on the person on your mind side. Because you got one, I feel like it's, it's more emotionally available than the other one. The other one is, is a more of a communicator, though. So you have to put who, where they belong, okay? <sighs> one, one, one. Mm-hmm. 
new beginnings though for you gemini's i feel like you're just getting a new lease on life that's just what i'm getting seeing lots of ones um on your side i'm headed your way soon just a new lease on life okay and i love it i can't take the silence anymore is this gonna come out in every reading now <laughs> you definitely pulled away from somebody i'm ready for real this time mm -hmm. they addicted to something are you seeing someone else i told you i told you they may ask you that too uh gemini they may ask you if you are seeing somebody else or if somebody else is in the picture or whatever for some of you that's the case or you just open yourself up to other possibilities i'm all alone oh child there could be like apologies too um, or something being made right too long by Jacob Lattimore. So this, I feel like, again, this is about somebody finding somebody else. Um, this person feeling like you found somebody else. It took too long for them to come back around. Um, or it took too long for them to apologize. It just took too long for, some, for them to do something, um, Gemini. So now you don't feel the same. You feel, and I, I, I feel like you feel a way about it. You feel some type of way about it. One Wish by Ray J. I haven't seen this one in a while for y'all. That's crazy. <laughs> I know you're the one for me because all these cards here, and they'd be the same ones that come out. I haven't seen that one in a, in a long time. Please tell me what you want. Yeah. I'm about to call slash text you. I told you. If you haven't, you know. Listen, you guys, this is, and I told you I was going to leave both of these in this deck to see if this happens, and it happened again. They can't take the silence. They can't take you um, pulling away. They can't take you becoming emotionally unavailable to them, uh, Gemini's. They can't take the fact that you see them how you see them. They can't take it. Child. My life was black and white until you came in and added color. Again, haven't seen that one in a while for you either. Let me just, let me get one more and dig in here and get something else. Nobody else by Summer Walker. All right, Gemini, ciao. Hit those likes, y'all. Hit that subscribe. Thank you for watching. Peace out.